Hello everyone, and welcome to the Wellness Way Lab Series. My name is Dr. Zach Poppendick, and today we're going to be talking about a test that you'll want to make sure is a part of your thyroid panel, and that's called Reverse T3. The Wellness Way Lab Series has put out a few videos on the thyroid. We've got videos on TSH, thyroid stimulating hormone, T4, and T3. And these are all types of thyroid hormones that should be tested when doing a complete panel. So to summarize, the thyroid itself produces a lot of T4, a little bit of T3, and it's up to the body to make sure that it has enough of both of these because T3 itself is the active hormone and that's what's going to be acting on our cells and stimulating metabolism. So what's reverse T3 then? Reverse T3 is the exact opposite of T3. It does not stimulate metabolism. It actually blocks the activity of T3. So is this something that your body makes? You bet. Kind of sounds backwards though, doesn't it? Why would your body want to make something that blocks an active hormone? Well, think about this. If your body's under an incredible amount of stress, it's got to have a way to protect itself. So when we're really stressed out, your body will actually try to protect itself from being overstimulated by those thyroid hormones. So what happens then, if you test your thyroid, you look at your TSH, it looks normal. You look at your T4, you got normal production. And T3, we've got a normal amount of our, our active hormone. So, so far everything's normal, but what if our reverse T3 is elevated? And I've seen this plenty of times. We can have reverse T3 be elevated to the point where our normal amount of hormone isn't enough to overcome. So what are the factors that are gonna elevate that reverse T3, make it go higher? Well, I already told you one, stress. And what is stress? Many different forms of it are gonna result in inflammation. The three T's, traumas, toxins, and thoughts. Talk about these all day in the office. What are those sources of the inflammation? Physical stressors, chemical stressors, and emotional stressors. So when your body's under stress, it needs to respond, and that's why reverse T3 is so important. Thank you for attending the Wellness Way Lab series. I'm Dr. Zach Poppendick, and we'll see you next time.